This attachment is so broken that it just got banned from ranked play. You can see here that I tried going into ranked play with this attachment on and it completely blocked it out. So today we're going to find out why. But not only that, all the top players are switching to the Cronin Squall because of its ridiculously fast time to kill. But the problem with the Cronin Squall is it has a recoil. Look at the recoil pattern here. This is me not even trying to control the re recoil whatsoever and you can see the recoil pattern is up and to the left so what people are doing is they're switching it over to semi-auto and look what happens when you spam shoot it the fire rate is virtually the same as when it's on full auto but there's hardly any recoil in comparison so today we're using the broken gun with the broken attachment to see just how broken they are but we're testing this in mini br solos because normal solos is still not in the game for some reason i really do wonder why a thermal sight is being considered super op and broken the only reason i could think of it being banned in ranked play is because maybe everyone's using smoke grenades in ranked play so a thermal sight kind of makes smoke grenades useless but maybe there's there's something completely wrong with it i have no idea the cronin squall having a ridiculously fast ttk i understand how that's super broken looks like someone is doing the stronghold someone's capturing the flag I, he was camouflaged i couldn't see him the past two days of warzone for me i've probably lost 95 percent of my gulag so i have very low expectations for how this is about to go he probably just sucked. What I really like about this mini solos mode is that these loadouts drop in super quick. So we get to test out our little Cronin Squall here really fast. Someone was looking at me, but we got to make sure we switch that to semi-auto. There he is. Oh, um, okay. That was kind of crazy. <laughs> One thing I noticed there with the thermal sight is that I had a lot more visual recoil than I do with something like the AMOP. Now that could be just because the thermal sight is zooming in further. I'm not sure. So that would result in making it harder for you to hit your shots, especially at longer range, which would be a hindrance in ranked play. So the only reason I could see people wanting to use a thermal sight and people calling it extremely broken is because people are just spamming smoke grenades in ranked. That's I don't know what else it would be. Maybe the reason people are using thermals because I could just sit here on a roof, just ADS, just scanning the horizon here and trying to see someone that I normally wouldn't see. Oh. Hey, man, we can't be letting that one happen. Wait, whoa! Oh my god okay i gotta stop being toxic i almost died for that and i would have completely deserved it bro i i don't see this guy almost drop it oh he's dropping on his loot he got out what what was that I have the perfect idea. Let's smoke it out and do this. It's not working. Where'd he go? There he is. Yeah, that's insanely good. That Cronin Squall is going to get nerfed quick. Someone else is looking at me. Ooh. This is intense. That's insane. Yeah, that's insane. Look, they're confused. They're wondering what just hit them. Oh, I just saw a guy. Dude, this is actually insane. This should have been nerfed yesterday. We got seven people left. Our zone is looking pretty small. There's no buildings to rotate to. We don't have smoke grenades left either. So this is going to be a bit difficult. Only thing I can think of that we should do would be maybe going up here to kind of have high ground on people. But I have a feeling there's going to be someone there already. We can rotate late though, because we got this gold gas mask. I thought I heard someone. Oh my God, Walter White just snuck up on me. There's always that one guy in the car. I think what we're gonna do here is eat zone with our gold gas mask and get up to our green marker up there and no one's gonna expect us to come in from the zone. The spot is perfectly in zone as well. I would love to shoot this guy in the truck, but I know as soon as I do, I'm exposing my location and I don't like being exposed in public. He's coming close to me. He's coming close to me. 
Does he know I'm right here? Oh my God. There is five people left somehow. Where are they? I feel like someone's gonna run up behind me. Oh, hello. Easy, four people left. Someone's very far away sniping. Probably was stupid of me to even shoot at him. I really do think we have the best spot. I think we're good. There's only three people left now. One of them's gotta be by the cars. And the other one I'm assuming is that sniper from a bit ago. Oh, I just saw a guy. Gotta hit those. There we go, 1v1. I have no idea where he is. He probably knows where I am because I was shooting. I'm just gonna use this tree as cover. Dude, I'm so scared he's behind me. Oh my God. Okay. I think he just jumped below the hill. We have no cover. This is so bad. There it is, baby! We got a W in the video! This is almost unheard of! To be fair, we're using a broken attachment with a broken gun, so maybe that's something to do with it. But Treyarch just tweeted out explaining why they were banned, and they were banned because the optics have the unintended ability to identify cold-blooded players through smoke grenades. So that explains why they were so broken, especially in ranked play where there's a bunch of people in the end zones and everyone's spamming smoke grenades. So if you were using cold-blooded, it was basically pointless. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and check out one of these two videos. Use the web. Peace.